French troops have engaged in hand-to-hand -hand conflict with Islamist fighters in Mali for the first time since the start of the conflict last week. The ground operation comes following airstrikes in a bid to halt the rebel advance southwards towards the capital of Bamako. Mali's northern territories have been under the control of jihadist groups since the coup last April. The French parliament has thrown its weight behind President Hollande in a virtually unanimous show of support for the campaign, but fears have kindled over possible reprisals by Islamist organizations across the Sahel, as security has been stepped up both in France and in Mali, where 6,000 French citizens are believed to be living. Islamist militants claim to have captured some 41 foreigners in an attack on a gas field in Algeria. Two employees, including a British national, are reported to have been killed, while around 20 Westerners, including French, British and American citizens, are being held hostage. Analysts are warning that porous borders and general lawlessness could see an escalation in violence across the Sahara region, which has been described as a hotbed of extremism. There are fears that jihadist groups may form a united front, opposing French military action in Mali and targeting foreigners across West Africa and beyond.